What's up guys, just pulled off the street at a local pond. I think we're in Frisco, Texas. <laughs> I've got a few rods in the truck with me, got the camera gear, and I figured we should pull off to the side and give this thing a shot. It's about 90 degrees and it's like 12 noon. So, I don't know if you'd call that prime conditions, but we're gonna go ahead and throw the Ned rig. We're gonna use the short little orange Walmart Zebco rod. I think it cost me like five bucks plus tax. And then we're gonna probably use the Shimano Scorpion because what I'm gonna do is throw the Ned Rig. Like I said, it's gonna be lightweight on that short rod, which is not gonna be very good casting, but with that reel, the digital cast control really helps so you throw lightweight lures, lightweight tackle. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, strap up with the GoPro. It's missing at the moment, but you know, it's right over here in the bag. And uh, we'll get straight to it. I've got a couple hours, so this could be good or it could be a massive failure and I just get exhausted out here in the sun, so. All right, we're geared up. I haven't tried this one before. I fished the one just across the street, so if there's any angry neighbors or security or no luck, then we've got a plan B. I'm thinking I'm gonna start casting out of the shade. Let's make a move over here, I think. Oh, somebody's getting a new Huracan delivered. Well, nothing at the first spot, unfortunately. Um, there's a couple kids out here fishing right now. I thought this guy had a catfish. It looks like that's what he's going for, but I think it's just a uh, bag, plastic bag or something. <laughs> Anyways, it's looking promising. We got some shade to cast from. I'm going to throw both of them again, probably the Ned Rig and the Chatterbait. Lots more turtles over here. Start off with the moving bait, the Chatterbait. <laughs> Didn't catch anything at the last spot. Made a quick pond hop. We're now closer to home. I got to be there in like a half an hour. So if we don't get anything, it's going to be lame. Gonna try and snag a few guys. I got the Ned Rig still and the Chatter Bait, and uh, nothing's pulling through. Still hot. Maybe we'll get something. All right, we even have a wacky rig too, if we feel the need. There's the little bluegills. Let's see if any bass are hanging around out here. Oh, bass right here. Here's a couple bass. Going towards it. Look, they're thinking about it. Going for the chatterbait. There we go. There we go. Got him. <laughs> right there by the dock, y'all. You saw it. That was pretty good. There we go. Cool. Can put a vlog together, folks. Man, we are happy. That's what I'm talking about right there. It only took a solid hour and a half worth of fishing, but he hit it right there under the dock. We're gonna go ahead and grab the other rod, toss him back, try and get some more. That's what I was waiting on. He took it right there. That was cool, y'all saw it. Ooh, I just wanted to get him because I knew I had to bite, but I wanted to kind of let him take it for a second because I wanted that fish. <laughs> I was just popping it real slow in between there and he was just hanging out. That was perfect. That's what you want to happen most times, but that doesn't happen. So, pretty thankful for that guy right there. Oh man, we can go home happy, time for Time to edit, y'all, but it's only one fish, so let's try and get a couple more 
while we're on a hot streak. Oh, oh, we're on. Hey, there we go. Oh, and we got the quick release. He's not too bad though. I think bigger than that last one, but he wasn't too. Maybe he was a pound and a half. He hit it right off the bat. Did y'all catch that? Y'all see I was not prepared for that bite. If it was a big one, it would have been frustrating. All right, last cast, gotta go. All right, wrapping things up with two solid catches. I didn't get that last one to the seashore, but that's all right. If you guys liked today's vlog, be sure to subscribe to the channel, share it with others that you know that might be interested in watching a couple fishing videos. Go ahead and hit the like button if you so please, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. If you're interested in the gear I was using today, I'm gonna have it linked in the description below for you guys to check out in case you wanna try it out for yourself. Peace out. <laughs>